So Kristen, we find it such a privilege to have you the new Secretary of Technology and State CIO. I know from personal experience what a change that is for you. What do you like most about your new role in the public sector? Well, thanks Molly, and it's been an incredible journey. I feel so flattered and humbled to be a part of this organization and to have this role and, and specifically the support that I've received from people like you um, has been amazing. So um, what I like about my job is the obvious, which is making a difference for all of the residents of Colorado. I mean, I'm a, a Colorado girl, you know, um, and so making that difference and, and uh, having that meaning in work is just so incredible. So tell me about you. You know, you just... You went from the dark side to the private sector, or vice versa, I'm not sure. Um, tell me about your new role and what you're doing. So as you know, I went through a long search to find my new home, and I'm happy to announce that I'm with the advisory services of Grant Thornton, and I work with an amazing team, actually a group of female leaders, so that is That's new great. and exciting. That's great. And the ability to think through some of the things that our clients struggle with and follow up and do research has been really, really exciting and rewarding because as you know, in the CIO role, you spend so much of your day reacting to things that are immediate and have your teams kind of following up. So I've really enjoyed the ability to do more of the introspective work that I didn't have an opportunity to do in the public role as a CIO. So tell me, what, what do you see, you know, coming into a public sector job, what do you see as kind of the biggest changes or the things that you have experienced from being both in public sector and private sector, the biggest differences between the two? The interesting thing is, I would talk about the similarities first. It's amazing. As I have moved into this consulting role and been talking to clients on the private side, how much I recognize their issues and the relationships between the finance department, IT, and the business units. It's so many of the similar struggles of what are our biggest priorities, what's our strategy, where should we invest in technology, and how are we going to pay for that? Some of the things that I'm finding are different are the ways you weight those things. So the decisions are made you know, differently in, in the public sector and in the private sector. With the public sector, so much of it is the public good, customer service, some of the time to deliver services, things like that. Around the private sector, of course, they care about all of those things, but they also have more of an immediate need on efficiencies and, and the return on investment. Shareholder value. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So I think it'll be really interesting over the next couple of years for us to stay in touch, share experiences, and um, I wish you the best of luck. Well, thank you so much. I I am indebted to you and the wisdom that you have imparted on me thus far. And um, as I joked earlier, Molly is now one of my phone-a-friend favorites on my (laughs) iPhone. And um, I am thankful for all of the work that you did and really the laying the foundation for how technology can be seen as a service to help um, government be efficient and effective and elegant and essential for the citizens of Colorado. Thanks so much, Molly. Thank you, Kristen.